you know that feeling you get after you see a good movie where you want to do something else, but you just can't? You can't watch another movie. You can't play a video game. You can't see a YouTube video. You just have to take it in. That's how I feel after seeing Ford v Ferrari. Yahoo, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Super Genki. I'm just here to recommend you to watch this movie, Ford v Ferrari. Like, wow, my head is still spinning after the movie. I'm not a racing and sports car kind of fan, but this movie really brought me into the genre because of its storytelling. And it is a historically based movie of, I think it's 1996 to 1969, where Ford made its first race car and they hired this this main character called Carol Shelby, and this is all historically historical stuff. And um, him, along with Ken Miles, created this car. But there's just like so much feud with like the corporate elites of the Ford company, and just the back and forth. It was so so good. So if I had to give it a rating, I'd be five out of five. And I say that because. When I see a movie, a new movie especially, I don't have much expectation for what I'm going to see. I don't get hyped up. I don't really watch new movies because I know a lot of them are just cookie cutter films nowadays. But I just stumbled onto this one and I'm so glad I finished it. Before you give it a shot, know that it is based on history and there's a lot more history with the people that are being portrayed in the movie. But remember, this is a, a movie. This is not a documentary. And if it was a documentary, I probably wouldn't have finished it. I probably just would have skipped it or watched something else. I think that the movie did this story much more justice than people give it credit for. Because some of the criticisms that I've seen about the movie is that it's not completely historically accurate. But in this day and age, if you want to get someone interested in the history, which I am now, I actually searched about um, who won the 24-hour Le Mans tour in Italy because that's the race that they're racing for. I searched who won this race and I was really surprised to find out that in the past two years that it's been done, Japan actually won. Um, Toyota, I mean. And I don't know, it's just it's that feeling that you want when you watch a movie. I don't know what people watch movies for nowadays because I don't watch many movies, but I would imagine you want some type of genuine feeling and something completely new and something novel, something that's going to make you be like, wow, that was a good movie. So everyone, if you're looking for a movie to watch, if you want to see something a little different, if you want to see Christian Bale and Matt Damon, beautiful performances, by the way, if you want to see them in the movie, Christian Bale is one of my favorite actors. I highly recommend that you check out this movie, Ford v. Ferrari. Very, very quality stuff. Anyway, everyone, that's the video for today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.